Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and uh, hey, we have a uh, version number, official version number for the next version of Windows 10. So Windows 10, of course, 20H1 being tested by insiders right now is um, in a new milestone. The uh, slow ring and fast ring have merged with the latest build yesterday of 10, 19,033. And it actually gives a version number now that says 2004. So uh, that ints had a release of April of 2020. Now we are in November of 2019. That is kind of far away. You might think, wow, they are really, really doing this from like a really uh, long distance. Well, that's because they are going to test it really a lot like they did before on the other versions. I think they just want to make sure that things work right. So uh, it's interesting to see that there is now a new version of Windows 10. Uh, you know, it's feature complete. It's pretty complete. Actually, uh, people on the insider rings can, uh, you know, start thinking that uh, they are getting and are close to what is the official version. There will be minor updates uh, coming up, but uh, now we have a little more information about what's going to happen. Um, we are going to look at uh, that uh, version of 20H1 and kind of a, have an advanced look today at what are some of the key new features that will come with that version of Windows 10. Not a lot, as you'll see when I actually show you. And I think that's fine. Um, honestly, for the most part, people will want to have simply a good and solid and working build of 20H1 and that's pretty much it. So uh, that's what we uh, are expecting, of course. So it's interesting to see that uh, we are uh, so early and uh, still, you know, uh, getting that uh, that number. There's no name, official name yet. You know, it's probably going to be called something like the, you know, April 2020 update. And I think they're going to continue on that way of naming things. So uh, we can probably say that uh, version 2004 will be the uh, April 2020 update because it will match with the the the, the uh, version number. And now, what's different with this is that the um, testing phase is very very long. You know, for most versions, what would happen is that they were actually, uh, you know, releasing it really close and then testing it a lot. And then it would extend the tests much longer. So what happened is, you know, the May 2019 update, for example, was uh, released, you know, uh, technically released early in, in March, but tested very, very long. Uh, and before they actually went to uh, release to the public. And same happened for the November 2019 update. That update, which was, which is, you know, when you look at the version numbers, 1909, uh, was released in, in September pretty much for, uh, you know, insiders roughly, end of September, early October. But it was tested and tested again until it was ready for them to release, which happened on November 12th. Now this time around it's different because because instead of having that built that version number in that uh, time when it's ready together, it's ready now, but they are already saying, okay, 2004, it's April 2020. We expect to release this. So they're going to probably have the correct time. It's a different way of actually um, making sure Windows 10 goes out at the time that they decide it should actually come out. So uh, that's what's happening in the future of Windows. We now know that 2004 is the version number for Windows 10, the 20H1 build. And I guess, you know, guess it's going to be April 2020 update. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.